expand this 2 into this is 2 plus 2x minus x minus x square I will simplify this 4x square minus 3x plus 5 divided by minus x square plus x plus 2 now this is proper fraction so we will divide this Four x square. This is improper fraction. Four x square minus three x plus five minus x square plus x plus two. This is improper. We'll come down to proper and polynomial. Minus four. We want to get the same term. So minus four. Four x square minus four x minus eight. Multiply throughout by minus sign x plus 13. Therefore, four x square minus three x plus five divided by minus x square plus x plus two. This is the factor of the given question. So directly we can write this one. Now well, this is a proper fraction. We will simplify this. x plus 13 we converted this a by 2 minus x plus b by 1 plus x by multiplying we get x plus 13 equal to a into 1 plus x plus b into 2 minus x put x equal to minus 1 I'll find the b value as 4 put x equal to 2 A equal to 5. The 4 this proper fraction this will show this I will see the third problem. Third problem. X cube plus seven x square plus seventeen x plus eleven divided by x square plus five x plus six. This is improper fraction, so we'll divide this.
x cube plus 7x square plus 17x plus 11 x square plus 5x plus 6 so division uh, we have seen already by opposite sign again by opposite sign to cancel the first term four x plus two plus x minus one by x square plus 5x plus 6 this is proper so we can factorize this we know this factorization 6 this is 5 3 twos are 6 So we'll uh, simplify this. X plus three by P by X plus two. By multiplying x minus 1 equal to a into x plus 2 plus b into x plus 3 x equal to minus 3 so we get b equal to 4 x equal to minus 3 a equal to minus 3 so let's substitute this Therefore, x cube plus 7x square plus 17x plus 11 divided by x square plus 5x plus 6 equal to x plus 2 plus we found the value of a equal to minus 3 substitute in this and b as 4 see the fourth, fourth problem fourth problem 2x square plus 3x plus 2 divided by x square minus 6 plus minus 2 this is improper we know how to divide this 2x square plus 3x plus 2 x square minus x minus 2 put two terms 2x square minus 2x minus 4 multiply minus sign throughout 5x plus 6 now we can write this term
by this we can factorize this we can write it as x we can write it as x minus 2 into x plus 1 because the factor is minus 2 minus 1 minus 2 1 now this is a proper fraction you can simplify this x plus 1 a by x minus 2 plus b by x plus 1 now we can know how to simplify this x equal to minus 1 b is equal to minus 1 by 3 put x equal to 2 16 equal to 3 a a equal to 16 by 3 therefore by substituting plus 16 by 3 x minus 2 minus 1 by 3 x plus 1 simplification you can try this see the fifth problem last problem fifth one Two x cube plus x square minus x minus three divided by x into x minus one into two x plus three. This is improper fraction. If we expand this, we'll come to know, which implies x minus one two x plus three. Multiply this x square minus x 2x plus 3 now multiply with this 2x cube plus x square minus 3x so we'll divide this term 2x cube plus x square minus x minus 3 2x cube plus x square minus 3x by multiplying by any sign throughout 2x minus 3 therefore 2x cube plus x square minus x minus 3 divided by 1 plus 2x minus 3 divided by x into x minus 1 into 2x plus 3 this is proper fraction you can simplify this a by x plus b by x minus 1 plus c by 2x plus 3 we know to multiply this term we get we get 2x minus 3 equal to a into x minus 1 2x plus 3 plus b into x into 2x plus 3 plus c into x into x minus 1 by substituting x equal to 1 we get b equal to minus 1 by 5 substituting x equal to 0 we will get x equal to 1 and by substituting by substituting x as 
minus 3 by 2 we get c is equal to minus 8 by 5 therefore 2x cube plus x square minus x minus 3 divided by x into x minus 1 into 2x plus 3 equal to 1 plus 1 by x minus 1 by 5 x minus 1 minus 8 by 5 2x plus 3 by this we have finished this partial fraction these are some important questions in board examination which they already asked the year is given we can try to solve this problem some are example problems We will see another topic in next video.